Good morning, Wiggle Bits. Welcome back to the final episode of Ark Sky Combat Mission 20. You gotta go see the last episode. I can't just snap my fingers and make a plane. Believe me, I wish I could. Right now, we needed one. Bad. When we were coming over on the boat, I remember seeing an aircraft carrier. That gave me an idea. The Admiral Anderson. The name of an old sailor. When the first drone started attacking, the ship wasn't ready for battle yet. It was still in the dock, getting all rigged up. So they rushed to get her ready. I know about Anderson. In the previous Ocean War, he was the commander of a ship that sent out the last fleet of jets. They say the deck was slipping so bad as it sank, the last plane barely made it off. Those fighters ended the war. That story gives me a little bit of hope, especially at a time like this. We're all in the same boat, like it or not. If this war keeps going on like it is, It'll be the end of everything. The military loaded this thing to the rafters with planes. Some were fighters that were going to be delivered to bases in occupied territory. It was hit before it could complete the mission. Jackpot. The hangars were loaded with goodies. This scrap queen's got work to do. Duck blue. Dark blue. Trigger, everyone, listen up. The operation was a success. Erosion defense forces have been neutralized, and all arsenal birds are down. However, those two new drones buzzing around have royally screwed up our plans. The Ocean and Erosion Coalition's air forces are in a sorry state thanks to them. We might not even have any viable aircraft. According to the Scrap Queen, the drones are trying to use the space elevator's transmission capabilities to send their data to drone manufacturing plants across the continent. They're trying to strengthen their numbers. What's worse, their data contains a depth of war experience. The newer aircraft will be more tactically advanced. If that's the case, this war will never end. We need to take both drones down no matter what it takes. We'll do it. So we have homes to go back to. Well, the Scrap Queen's on our side. She says she can make any aircraft fly. This is our final mission. Trigger, let's go. We've got a goddamn war to end. Yeah! That's it? Alright, some allies. That's it? Alright. Any aircraft fly. I wonder if I have access to every everything, though. Nope, not really. Uh, let's get this final upgrade, I guess. Nope. Damn it. Alright, well, let's go... I don't know what to do. All right, well, let's just get in there, I guess. Scoo 45. Uh, I need these air-to-air -air missiles. Parts. Alright, that'll do it. Uh, I'm gonna need, actually, I think I'll go with some survivability. Let's take off some of these defenses and get some survivability up in this.
There we go. Don't need too much. Strider Squadron, take off prep complete. Ooh. Ooh. All right. It's only been five minutes. Final mission. Du -du 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 -du. Let's use the catapult system and we're going. The drones. I think everybody here knows the score. We all know who to follow. Commence mission. All aircraft, follow trigger. Roger that. Understood. All right. Understood. Roger. The space elevator is able to get these the dicks. With the information infrastructure down, it's the only place capable of wide area data transmission. Drones are waiting for it to power up again. Clever little bastards. Nickel. Go to launch pad. All aircraft converge on Skull Squadron. Surround and shoot them down. Strider 3, copy. Let's do it, Ocean. You may be reacting. Damn, they're fast. All aircraft stay sharp. Intercept now. Whoa! Get back here, you drone! We can do it! Aim well and shoot him down! Good. The enemy is still flying normally, though. Keep pushing. Damage has to be adding up. Oh! The UAV is going to the laser weaponry. Watch where their nose is pointing. Bullets. Guys, help out here! Trigger, enemy 
Where's the other drone? Is that it? That can't be it. Son of a bitch, he's still going. Not really doing anything. Oh, and damn it. Got it. What the hell is that? Trigger, you're gonna have to fly into the tunnel after the UAV. What? 
Victor. There's enough space for him to turn beneath the elevator. That's a suicide mission. Count, where are you going? We rely on Trigger too much. He's gonna need help. You can't be serious, Count. Yeah, well, you had no problem with Trigger doing the same thing. Trigger's different. We'll see. Oh, God. Don't worry. I learned something from my last squadron. Stick with Trigger, and you'll make it. Count, give me your status. Live. There it is. You may be spotted. We might have found it. Oh, God. <laughs> this is gonna be a hard one. Oh, at least I got a checkpoint. <laughs> okay, this is gonna be a hard one. Count, where are you going? We rely on Trigger too much. He's gonna need help. You can't be serious, Count. Yeah, well, you had no problem with Trigger doing the same thing. Trigger's different. We'll see. You damn fool. Count, give me your status. Alive. Excellent. So you're both okay. Okay, I gotta be careful with the speed. This is this is gonna be hard. Oh god. Oh god, the flying is tight and the inversion. I've been playing inverted all this time. Jesus. I can do this. Full speed ahead, let's go! You can't be serious, Count. Yeah, well, you had no problem with Trigger doing the same thing. Trigger's different. We'll see. You damn fool. Count, give me your status. Alive. Excellent, so you're both okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What makes you think that? No time to explain. The radio will cut out soon. It'll take a short time for the drone to send over the data. There it is. You may be spotted. You finally found it. I heard some static when the gate closed. Do you think the UAV is operating the gates? Well, there goes our only way out. I thought we were going to pull this off after making it through that base. No sign of the drone. Did it take another path? Doesn't matter. We know where it's going. We can catch it. Okay, I need to make sure my mouse pad is straight because this is kind of creeping me out, to be honest. Be okay. Uh oh, that's quite the problem. It appears I can't get any more thrust. Hey, there you are, you dick! <laughs> I'm below sea level, which is. Damn it! Ah, oh, I'm gonna have to be quicker about that. Got it. Hey, I'm being serious here. That's right, we're going home. I thought of a way out of here. The space elevator. If we break 
is hollow, and there's no ceiling all the way up. Not yeah. Oh god, are you serious? Okay. I wanted to wait until I had less fuel, but I have no choice. Attempting to land. I don't think my plane will make it. Anyway, here goes. Come on, you can do it. These things are, these modern jets are pretty strong. Oh, I just lost him. Hell. Oh. Look, it's Trigger. Strider 1 has returned to radar. I did it! That's our Trigger! He's a damn hero! <laughs> no doubt. You're better than me. Where's Strider 2? Damn it. Does anyone have eyes on count? Wish y'all could have seen that. What's your position? Watching Trigger climb. I guess it's my fate to watch from down below. Yeah, well, we're all in the same boat there. Yeah, well, I guess we are. We're sending help. Give us the coordinates. Directly under the space elevator. Elevation is minus 500 meters. Minus? Hey, Trigger. You dumbass. Tell me something. What colors the sky up there? We're on our way back to Earth Avenue Mission to the asteroid belt. I can't tell you how proud I am to be the first to land a Wait, what was that transmission? This is Captain K. Nagase of the Spaceship Pilgrim 1. The ocean of stars in our galaxy is finally within our reach. To the pilot who generously gave this spaceship a place to dock, we are forever grateful. The universe lies ahead of us. Waiting to be discovered. And now, at last, we have a gateway to ascend to it. Over and over again. It's all coming together for me. Today was the day, the moment of her return. I salute the pilot who gave us all a future. Unknown. The path to mankind's vast future remains standing, Granddad. Oh, great. I hear music. I hope it's not copyrighted. I'm certain the that last orchestra was copyrighted. for themselves copyrighted. at the base of the space elevator. A humanitarian mission from Yuktovania airdropped some supplies for them again today. Thanks to the princess, the whole world was pitching in to help these people. Handing out the relief supplies would have been a perfect gig for that anarchist dude. But since he's dead now, the job went to the guy from Belka, George. I guess Tabloid got that new system he wanted in the end. <sighs> Mihai's granddaughters are helping out too. Mihai. That cranky old geezer's here with us, too. I never wanted to create anything, and now here I am, clinging to life. Watching as my grandchildren and their generation make a new future for themselves and the world. Is this my punishment, then? All I do is lie here, wasting away. I'll never know the freedom of flying the open skies ever again. I've been grounded, and my wings have been clipped. You know what having peace in the world means? It's being able to die in your own bed at a ripe old age. Peace is what those girls are working so hard for here. We got a bunch more refugees today. And the princess? 
She's looking to the stars. Dark blue. To the heavens and beyond. Well, that's it. That's the. That's that. Oh. Well, I had to snip that last part due to uh, due to copyrighted music, and I don't want French people copywriting my stuff. Uh, all right. Uh, you can now choose uh, aircraft skins from. Okay. All right. Well, that's it. Uh, all right. I will see all of you in the next episode. I love every single one of you. That, tune in next time for more, and peace.